back in like 2013, there was a rise in the use of commercial drones. But what wasn't being created was a drone that could deliver essential medicines, vaccines, lab samples to remote areas, to their island networks, to mountainous regions, to places that are seasonally flooded. And so we started Bayou with kind of this explicit intention to design a drone that can meet those use cases. So that was a vehicle that could take off and land from any location, no runway or launch required, travel a long range, initially the goal was 60 kilometers, we're now up to 100 kilometers, carry a significant payload, around 2 kilograms, which is a significant number of lab samples, of blood product, medicines, and then be fully autonomous, such that it could be used by healthcare workers. Right now we're looking at deploying fleets to Western Africa, to the Senegal, and most of those are for transport of lab samples, vaccines, medical commodities. And there's of course you know, opportunities to consider in other sectors, in oil and gas where you might need a spare part of an offshore oil rig or e-commerce operations in developing countries that are starting to grow, or the postal service. But really what Bayou is looking at for operations in 2018 is to really move the needle and go directly towards pilot trials of you know, extended duration, weeks or months, that are intended to lead to implementation of the technology for a routine or on-demand delivery, um, and start to understand what would be you know, the cost and logistics for implementing that sort of network.